Hey there, this is Bill Schulteis. I'm the creator of The Coffee House Investor. And my mission is to work with you so that together we can help everyone build wealth, ignore Wall Street, and get on with their lives. 20 years ago, I created The Coffee House Investor. I authored a book by the same name, and in the book, I focus on three simple principles that we all know to be true. Don't put all your eggs in one basket. There's no such thing as a free lunch and save for a rainy day. Now, over the past 20 years, investors who have focused on those three principles and who have ignored the stuff that's coming out of Wall Street have shared with me that it's had a profound and positive impact on their life. And I'm convinced that investors who are looking for clarity with their investment decisions and who focus on these three principles over the next 20 years will have as great an experience as investors who have focused on them over the past 20 years. Over the next three weeks, I'm going to take each principle in isolation and share with you how you can integrate it into the decisions that you make in your portfolio and into your lives. And I think it's going to be more important than ever before for two reasons. Number one, the stock market is likely to be as volatile as it's ever been simply because of the times we live in. And second, the asset classes that we invest in, primarily stocks and bonds, are likely to generate returns below their historical averages, if for no other reason than they're trading at pretty high levels today. And it's going to require that investors maximize their returns in these asset classes that they invest in to accentuate their chances of reaching their financial goals. Now, Wall Street and much of the financial industry encourages us to focus on the headline news as we make our investment decisions on a monthly and yearly basis. I mean, just look at the headline news over the past week. Low liquidity curbs stock trades. Here's another one. Market rally as Chinese ease credit. A little closer to home, recession tops the list of US CEO fears. And finally, the euro had its calmest year ever and currency watchers think it can continue. Now much of the financial industry is suggesting that we keep up with the headline news as we make for portfolio decisions. For coffee house investors, these headlines are totally irrelevant. What matters most of all is that we focus on things that we can control. The three principles that I share in my book, don't put all your eggs in one basket, there's no such thing as a free lunch, and save for a rainy day are in our control over the next three weeks. I'm going to show you why. For today, this is Bill Schulteis, the Coffee House Investor. I'll catch you next week.